What influenced me to apply for the medical assisting program was uh, personal experience of a loved one uh, being diagnosed with cancer, going through chemotherapy. I was going to appointments uh, all the time and came to appreciate the role of the medical assistant and how important they are in a patient's health care. What influenced me to apply for the medical assisting program was um, just my love for people and for helping them. Um, when I was younger, I always just loved gravitating towards people that were hurting and doing anything I could to help them. And I went overseas a couple of times and just saw a lot of sadness and hurt there. And it just really inspired me to want to do more and to just be able to help people any way I can. The people that come into the program that do really well are really the ones that are so passionate about taking care of people. The program is very specifically designed for patient interaction, for patient care, so it's helping us treat it like as a work environment. We dress in scrubs every day, we have to wear our name tags, we, we check in, we check out at the beginning of every day, same as we would do in a clinical environment. The program is preparing us for working with patients by doing everything as close as a work environment as possible. PCC medical assisting programs, like all medical assisting programs, provide students with the administrative and clinical skills necessary to work in a clinic um, as a medical assistant. On the clinical side, we have um, things like drawing blood or taking blood pressure, how to room a patient. Um, on the administrative side, we've already gone through some lab courses dealing with computers and the programs uh, that we'll be using. In the fall, we focus primarily on administrative duties of the medical assistant. Winter term, we focus on the clinical duties. And then spring, we have the opportunity to do an externship placement out in the community to practice all of those skills. This program is nine months. You earn a one-year certificate. You do have some transferable credits. Some students end up with an associate's degree, depending on how many credits they had um, prior to coming into the program, as well as how many credits they needed for their prerequisites. So I like going through this program with a set group of people because it gives you a feel for what it would be like to work with a team and it also is very supportive and they can help you through it because they know kind of what you're going through. Everybody's like a family and if one person feels like they're falling behind, you have an army of people behind you to help you catch up. Since I've been in this cohort, it's been extremely upbeat. Everyone really cares about what they're doing and we all want to see each other succeed. Our academic training model is a cohort model, which means students start together and they go through every single course together and then they graduate together. So you're with the same group of students the entire nine months that you're in the program. We go over anything that could possibly happen in clinics and every scenario and it helps all of us MAs be very prepared for what we'd be dealing with when we're actually in clinics. We focus on patient-centered uh, care. Uh, we're often taught how to explain a procedure before we do it, but also explain why we're doing it to help put the patient at ease. What sets us apart is our emphasis on soft skills training. Uh, soft skills means that we put greater um, support, emphasis, and training on communication, critical thinking, and teamwork. Another opportunity that sets PCC apart is the community health fair where students practice their clinical skills and soft skills prior to externship. One word that I would use to describe the learning environment is encouraging. Inspiring. Challenging. Supportive. Interactive. Very supportive. That was two words. Reinforcing. Inclusive. Amazing. 